The price of Bitcoin climbed to a record high of about $69,000 Tuesday morning, continuing a months-long rally and helping fuel a surge in other cryptocurrencies as it keeps ticking upward from its 2023 doldrums. Bitcoin's rise marks a major rebound from its 2022 and 2023 lows, including in November 2022 when prices hovered just over $16,000 in the wake of crypto exchange FTX's epic collapse. Persistent recession fears and near-record inflation also contributed to Bitcoin's decline over the past two years. One pessimistic inflation report in September 2022 prompted Bitcoin to plummet nearly 10%, as investors pulled back their assets over fears high inflation and repeated interest rate hikes by the Federal Reserve could coincide with a so-called crypto winter. Bitcoin's resurgence began late last year, rising to roughly $44,000 by New Year's Day as investors anticipated federal regulators to approve spot ETFs and as the Federal Reserve hinted at upcoming interest rate cuts. Despite its recent gains, Bitcoin has drawn a mixed reception from analysts and economists since its debut over a decade ago. Last December, JP Morgan Chase CEO Jamie Dimon said he is deeply opposed to Bitcoin and cryptocurrency generally at a high-profile Senate hearing, suggesting crypto exists to fund a legal business. Diamond urged lawmakers at that hearing to close the industry, arguing its true use is for criminals, drug traffickers, and people trying to dodge taxes. Diamond's opposition to crypto seemed to taper off one month later, when the CEO called Bitcoin a pet rock that does nothing in an interview with CNBC's Squawk Box. Senator Elizabeth Warren, D. Mass, has also targeted crypto including in a December letter to Coinbase, Coin Center and the Blockchain Association, demanding answers on those organizations' use of a revolving door to undermine efforts to rein in crypto's use in terrorist financing. Bitcoin tops $60,000. First time since 2021, Forbes' Bitcoin price tops $67,000, could hit all-time high this week, Forbes.